This video informs you about the basics of cataracts and cataract surgery. During your evaluation, we can discuss your individual situation in more detail, and I can answer any questions you may have. Cataract surgery is the most common surgery performed in the U.S. and has an extremely high success rate. We will start with a brief description of the eye and how it relates to cataract surgery. The very front surface of the eye is called the cornea, which is clear, like a watch crystal. Light entering through the cornea is focused on the back of the eye. In fact, the cornea does most of the focusing work of the eye. If your cornea happens to be curved more in one direction than the other, you have what is called astigmatism. Most corneas are round, like a basketball, but if your cornea is stretched more in one direction, it is more like a football. This unequal curvature blurs your vision and requires glasses or contact lenses to correct. Behind the cornea is the colored part of the eye known as the iris. The dark opening in the center of the iris is the pupil, through which light enters the eye. The lens of the eye is just behind the iris. Along with the cornea, it focuses light onto the back of the eye to provide clear sight. When we are born, the lens is clear like glass, but with time it turns yellowish brown and blocks some of the light coming in. The discolored lens is called a cataract. The symptoms that cataracts cause resemble a dirty windshield in your car. The overall vision is blurred and dim, which glasses cannot improve. Patients often complain they can't see road signs well or that reading has become more difficult. Golfers state they have trouble following the golf ball. Colors are dull and some patients even think their televisions need replacing. At night, halos or starbursts are seen around lights. Or double vision called ghosting may occur. It may be difficult to appreciate what you've been missing until your cataracts are removed. At your initial visit during your cataract evaluation, one of our technicians will perform a comprehensive set of diagnostic tests. These will include dilating your eyes and checking your vision, prescription, eye curvature, and eye pressure, ensuring that we have a complete understanding of your eye health Every eye is unique. As part of your evaluation, I will thoroughly discuss the risks, benefits, and alternatives of cataract surgery. I will also assess your eyes and recommend the type of advanced technology options that may be suitable for improving your vision. The power of the lens implant is based on several measurements taken during your evaluation. The goal of cataract surgery is to remove the cloudy lens and replace it with a clear lens. There are lens options that can reduce your dependency on glasses. We will discuss these lens options that best suit you and your lifestyle during your evaluation, even if your distance vision is perfect without glasses. Depending on the lens that you choose, you may still require glasses for reading. Advanced technology options are available for patients who choose to have laser-assisted cataract surgery or a specialized IOL implanted at the time of their surgery. Monofocal lens implants, also known as traditional single vision lenses, focus on one specific point which can be set for distance, intermediate, or near vision. These implants provide the best possible vision at the chosen point. Toric lens implants are specifically designed to reduce or eliminate astigmatism. These implants are set for one specific point, which can be set for distance, intermediate, or near vision. These implants provide the best possible vision at the chosen point. They may also improve contrast sensitivity in low light situations and improve vision in challenging environments like fog and night glare. A multifocal lens option is available for patients who wish to restore their vision across varying distances. Multifocal lenses feature concentric circles with varying powers, allowing the eye to focus at different distances, 
the center of the lens is optimized for distance vision, while the surrounding rings provide clear vision at intermediate and near ranges. The light adjustable lens implant can be customized to your eye and visual requirements. With the light adjustable lens, you can test different vision settings, allowing you to achieve your personal ideal eyesight and reducing or even eliminating the need for eyeglasses in most daily situations. The unique feature of the light adjustable lens is that the shape and focusing characteristics can be changed after implantation in the eye using an office-based UV light source called a light delivery device. Our patient education counselor will go over these options with you. While many of these lenses can reduce your dependence on glasses, prescription eyewear may still be required. It is important that you do not have anything to drink or eat after midnight the day before surgery. For safety reasons, you need to have an empty stomach at the time of surgery other than medications. This is a common cause of surgery cancellations. Cataract surgery is an outpatient procedure where you will undergo light IV sedation, similar to other outpatient procedures. Because you will have IV sedation, you will need someone to drive you on the day of surgery, and you should not drive for 24 hours after surgery while recovering. The surgery itself only takes about 10 to 15 minutes, but you should plan to be at the surgery center for approximately two to three hours. Just like your initial cataract evaluation, we use drops to dilate the pupil in preparation for surgery. Once you are completely comfortable, I will remove your cloudy lens. This is accomplished by making a small incision in your cornea and using an ultrasound probe to break up your cataract and vacuum it away. Following cataract removal, I will implant the intraocular lens that was chosen during your cataract evaluation. Remember, the type of lens placed will be chosen based on its specific benefits for your unique vision needs. You can go home within a half hour after surgery and you will be required to return the next day for your post-op visit. The other eye is typically done the following week. You can resume your normal activities after surgery, but no rubbing of the eye or getting water or chemicals into the eye until after full healing, which takes about four weeks. Following cataract surgery, it is very important to continue taking your prescription eye drops as directed by your doctor. These drops can be conveniently purchased right in our office. Once removed, cataracts cannot grow back, but months or years later, it's common for the bag holding the implant to become cloudy. This is called a secondary cataract. For a secondary cataract, a laser is used to create a small opening in the bag, allowing for clearer vision. This simple and effective procedure ensures that your vision remains as clear as possible. After the second eye has healed, we will release you to follow up with your local optometrist to continue with your eye care needs. As a reminder with any surgery, there are risks. The infection rate of cataract surgery is about one in 1,000, which is unlikely to occur. Patients with certain medical conditions like diabetes, autoimmune diseases, or cancer are more prone to getting infections from any surgery the symptoms of an infection usually occur within a week or two of surgery and include severe pain, redness, and decreased vision. Because of these small risks of complications, we do not do both eyes at the same time. The retina is a delicate part of the eye and can swell after cataract surgery in some patients, especially diabetics. This can cause blurry vision called macular edema, but it can usually be treated with drops or other treatments. An emergency phone number is available if you experience any of these symptoms after cataract surgery. Eye Surgeons of Indiana offers convenient financing options through Care Credit. Care Credit is subject to credit approval and can be used towards cataract surgery, LASIK, dry eye treatments, exams, and more. Please speak with a member of our staff if you would like to learn more about your financing options or have any questions. 
After watching this video, I am happy to address any questions or concerns you may have about your evaluation, advanced technology lens options, and surgery.